Hi, this is another video on GAN angle series. I think it's going to be a series because of uh, first two part is not possible to cover up all these factors of GAN angles. So uh, now uh, we are discuss about uh, on closed basis. Last two videos I am showing you. Uh, I just uh, showed you the turning point by the high low calculation of GAN angles, and right now we are going for. Uh, close to close basis means calculation from the close to close okay see the angles have a beauty because of uh, it's a no lagging tool it's based on tan line it's not based on angles it's a tan line based okay so everybody wants to see is uh, all are the tan lines so if you are zoom zoom in zoom out so there is no change inside of that if you zoom any anywhere so uh, there is no change these are the fixed lines okay see uh, I want to show you the intersection of two bullish and bearish angles with a high low and as well as the new forecasting method or new turning point method which is showing you today uh, on past videos. Okay, uh, so see here is the intersection goes to be here somewhere. It's the last candle. Okay, the four candle up. The next intersection is came to be here, which is the again the upside moment. Intersection came here after that again upside moment, like that. Uh, let me take the arrow again. Okay. See the intersection. The first intersection is supposed to be uh, where it is. Okay, here, this one, right? The another one came here. This one. See the intersection of dotted line. I show you the which is the angle both are. This one is a line from one point one by six, and this one a line from the one by six. Both are one by six lines. Okay, like a one to one angle intersection or a forty five degree intersection. Okay, there is another change. See here. I'm sorry, I need to delete. See the calculation from open and close. Open and close means the falling angle and again rising angles. Now, need to zero once. Came back. Okay, here is the intersection point. Uh, if everybody wants to see, see the, this one. Here, six by six angle in center. Here, see all the intersections. Major intersection points here. See the point out on this bar, which is the bottom bar. Lower close bar. Okay. The another one came here. There is a lot of so don't worry about it. Here is again the second bar up to down trail. And see the support and resistance are beautifully performed the gear angles because see the intersection point exactly bottom out uh, with the two different angles which is a 124 and it's a 16 which is a multiplier of 6 24 and 6 so it's got an exact bottom at side second candle this one i think we capture each and every swing from here once and this one 
or this one maybe yeah this center point of that and uh, there is a lot of no worry but uh, see this one dotted line here is a underline where the intersection this one cross to be at bullish bar this one intersection here so maybe two three bar is bullish then this came back to down here as well both are same this one this one this one see the bottom here and so on see the accuracy of angles exact testing of the high low here here the exactly tested on high right now tested on low okay you need to draw each and every every angle and everywhere so first you need to take the first high low then it's breaks then takes a new high low okay then only apply it so need to be drawn like a previous one and go to the first one okay so zero six falling angle okay see here the by we can't see because of multiple angles from low to high high to low like that so uh, right now you able to see see the high exactly high after that market came down for 3 4 hours continuously it also came here at same bar this one this one okay intersection of point both are same where we plot here is some changes here is a different bar this one is a buying bar because market is sloping down okay and there is uh, maybe we got from high uh, some somewhere here okay here this one is a top from this bar and lots more from here definitely goes up okay so all are done with the intersection point of where angles you have got a multiple swings but uh, our concept is a different we need to hide the secondary angles okay there is a older arrows need to be find out here and uh, we need to process the close to close value like that the previous one and we need to follow only the main angles so just try to apply the faster okay so need to check where the intersection point is high I deleted the arrows also related inside. So we are going to zero. Okay, there is a turning point and same bar intersection point here. The bottom exactly. the another one goes to be here somewhere 
this one is next to Vibulis. Okay, the, another one we need to take uh, from this side, this side. Okay, uh, this one may be high, so only two bar, three bar difference inside. So X and U low, this one is a low, and just take at this line to here. It's already on same bar. We are already plotted here. It's intersect here, so there is another loop. Uh, sorry, it came from bottom, so it's a four bar upside. And another one here, this one, okay, it's good so far. So take another one. This one, we'll take this one. So we got a first value here, somewhere here. It's already is bullish from intersection of points, but uh, with the forecast, there is a different one. And here as well, the market trending maybe two three bar up. It skims down. Hello, it's upside. Take another one. Take a major low here. Okay, we got somewhere this far. Okay, here is a no breakout form of our downside. It's a bottom here. That the three four candles goes up. And, and so far, it's a long low. Now, we will check another way. Uh, this one. It's a two bar difference or uh, something here. We got here as well. We got uh, somewhere. See the bottom here. After that, the market moves up, goes highly upside. Okay, so there is a another way. There is a another low breaks here. There's a major low. From major low, try to find out some major point points will came or not. Market goes up and down. Here is a consolidation form. Maybe uh, somewhere the, the center of candle, so maybe this side. So. Another point came here. Okay, so there is a the market sloping uh, up and there is a major low you found. So after that, you can just delete it and uh, uh, apply the bullish angles. Okay, see in the first swing here, we applied from the high. This is a high. The another one here is turned to down. The another one got here from this bar it's another swing here let's take some bullets of bearish yeah it makes a turn down or up so uh, if i breaks then only goes up it's down break so need to be turned uh, in same direction no no worry and there is a another one uh, here here okay it's so far takes another one this one forward to line upside check here somewhere here second from here and it makes sense this one okay so there is a different method to forecasting these things and uh, you can apply with a different different one but uh, it's a close to close is more precise uh, high low also works, but don't worry. Uh, there is a uh, all methods are works inside of that. So hope you understand. So please make sense here. It's uh, okay. It's you got a bottom. You got uh, exactly uh, the different top. Here you got a bottom. 